Okay guys, welcome to my new video. And uh, this is gonna be quite an interesting one because now that we actually do know what entangled nodes are, how long would it actually take you to break even? How long would it actually take you to hypothetically make your money back? And what would the price not have to go below? As, um, yeah, that would be an interesting one. And we are gonna be talking about what the likely chances of it actually going below that price. So. Yeah, this is going to be quite interesting and hopefully you guys do enjoy. And as always, this is not financial advice. Make sure you check out my links in the description below to basically get yourself involved and uh, kind of get you guys into learning more about what you know Stronger does and many other passive incomes. Also, my other channel, obviously, which we do go through everything that we don't go through in this channel. So anything you guys have requested, I mostly... I'm I mostly not I mostly I mostly answer in that other channel so make sure you go and check that out and yeah hopefully you guys do enjoy this video so yeah, let's get started also I want to show you guys something I couldn't find this yesterday um so I found it right now as you can see here so th this is what basically entangled notes are so we've spoken about this in my first video check it out and you know basically talk about everything you need to know For some reason why it's not loading right now but make sure you go you guys check it out because you are going to be able to understand more about what entangled nodes are. Basically, you have a 20 token limit, okay? And uh, this is a good example. So let's say you bought a node for $6,000 and the price drops like it did now. That means that you would most likely have a $4,500 loss with entangled nodes. And this is one of the big risks that you do kind of go to if you do sell your stronger stronger tokens but many people would likely sell their stronger tokens rather than hold them since they would see the value dropping and just human psychology would basically um pursue them to you know market sell them rather than limit selling them or anything like that or stop limit so yeah this is something that kind of was stuck in my head and kind of made me think to myself is it really worth it and i just want to show you guys something <laughs> and people are just um yeah people are just uh, showing you guys that this is something that they're not happy about too and uh, so what what's going to happen to the old node that was created before and that's the question we are all waiting for to be answered better get an ama ace up guys definitely agree about that and uh, yeah everyone's not very happy about this also this is another positive so it could double in price and you would make of a double in profit no huge gas fees either just claim all your nodes for the cost of one could be worth it if you are going to get more than one node okay and even if you do get more than one node, is it really still worth it? I'll let you guys decide on that, okay? And uh, also, the rewards you will be getting, meaning the coin, not the price of the coin. Come on, man. Just like anything in crypto, you put your money in a mark, you, you put in money, market tanks, you lose out. So, you can have a win or you can lose. And this is a big gamble. And, I, you know, I, I'm not a gambler, so... I don't get involved in gambling. If you guys want to gamble or see this as a feasible investment opportunity, go ahead. But if something has a limit and the price has been dropping for eight months now, okay, from $1,200 to $20, okay, go ahead. But I've just shown you guys my opinion. I'm not trying to show you guys. I'm not trying to make you guys think stronger is bad. I'm, I'm also an investor, okay? I'm showing you something that I'm also invested in. So don't... You know, I, I do see your comments saying you, you're just talking smack about Stronger, but guys, keep in mind, I'm also an investor. I want this project to succeed. I want this project to do well. And we are in Q2 now, keep that in mind. And everything is going as planned, but the price is not reflecting that, which is concerning because bullish news should be bullish price action. But imagine if it's not bullish news, what would we be getting? It would just be bearish, right? That's something to think about, guys. But yeah, um, so how long would it actually take you to break even? And we are going to be talking about that. We've, we've spoken before that you are going to have a 20 node um, stronger limit. So you are going to be making around 0 0.075 stronger a day. It's going to take you around 266 days to break even at this current price. If, however, okay, by the way, this is, this is always going to be the same. You're always going to, you, you, you're going to stop making your stronger tokens by this. So you have to wait 266 days, okay? And the price has to stay the same for you to double your money. And most likely we will be seeing the price most likely drop because the trend is for the price to be dropping. Unfortunately, because every every month, you know, we do see the downward candle and most likely every day we, we have been seeing this price constantly be dropping lower and lower and lower. But if, you know, hypothetically we were not to drop much, you know, or 
we if you were to buy right now okay we would not want price to go below 24 dollars this would be the area for where you can happily sell your nodes and not make a loss or make a profit you'll literally make nothing and that that's the price but you'll most likely encounter your ethereum gas fees and that's something that you know you will have to pay so preferably anything above 25 dollars if you buy it right now so yeah that's something that you have to keep in mind if you are wanting to be buying an entangled node as of right now and yeah hopefully you have enjoyed this video as you may know this is not financial advice always do your own research and hopefully you guys do enjoy and peace